Hello, yoga people. How are you? Today, I want to talk to you about the hot yoga sit-up. What's going on there? We never have enough time to really talk about it to break it down during a class. Every once in a while, the teacher gets to it, and it's cool, and it's exciting. Oh my god, what are they talking about? But usually, we're so exhausted by that point. I'm just gonna take a nap in Savasana while you talk for a minute. So really, what's going on in the sit-up? Let's break it down. Yoga breakdown. The first step is the setup. The setup for the sit-up. Get it? Your whole body should be flat on the floor. Feet flexed, toes and heels together. Arms way up over the head. Your arms are with your ears. Your thumbs should be crossed with your palms facing up towards the ceiling. Just imagine I'm laying on my back. Thumbs crossed, palms facing up towards the ceiling. So already, your arms and ears are glued together. Your arms should stay with your ears the whole time. A lot of people make the mistake of flinging their arms as they sit up. It's like the Hail Mary pass, just whoa! Just keep your arms with your ears. Keep your feet flexed. Take a deep breath. And then sit all the way up. The trick is, when you sit up, the arms and ears stay together, and you try to make a wide arc with your arms all the way up and over. Touch your forehead to your knees, and there's a quick double exhale. It sounds like That helps get all the waste and stale air out of your lungs and makes room for more oxygen coming in. When you do the double exhale, Curl in as tight as you can and try to touch your forehead to your knees. You get the deep forward bend, you get all the wasted air out and make room for fresh oxygen. This sit-up is highly energizing. It's designed to set you up for the next posture. That's all I've got for today. If you guys have any questions or comments, post them in the field below. I'll talk to you soon. Zeb out.